If you've ever sent a connection request to somebody and you want to withdraw it, here's how to do that on LinkedIn. So we're on LinkedIn home screen here. I'm going to click on my network. Okay, and here are, these are invitations to me on my um, network. But if we go and click on here, see all three, it says manage invitations. So if you click on sent, these are invitations you have sent to people that have not been um, accepted or ignored. So they're still sitting as um, unaccepted invitations in these people's inboxes. So all you need to do is go and click on withdraw. If you withdraw, you cannot resend to this person for the next three weeks. So do think about it carefully. Do you want to withdraw your connection? And I'll say that it's really interesting because people don't log into LinkedIn all the time. So you may have sent um, a connection request in the last week or two weeks and it hasn't been accepted. It does not mean that person won't accept it. Um, so, but these people don't want to accept my connection request, so I will just withdraw them. You can also see, if you click on here, I've invited people to connect to follow my page. And people don't always like to be invited to do that, so you could also withdraw these. <laughs> Unfortunately, you cannot bulk withdraw those invitations, so they're just going to have to sit there. And then on the events, this is when you've invited people to come along to your event. And you'll see all the names here, people that you invited to your event and you can withdraw. Now, you don't need to worry about necessarily these people who you invited to your event because the event is past now anyway, but that's, it's managing the invitations you sent to people can be done right here. So if you want to go and check your network and see who you invited to join a connection with you who didn't accept it, that's how you do it. For more tips and advice on using LinkedIn and secret little hacks like this, just hit subscribe and stay tuned for my next video with um, LinkedIn with Louise.